Welcome to another video. Today I'll be talking about the climate control unit that I have updated on the Golf Mark 7. So this is the touchscreen version that has just come out. So that shows the all the settings in in the car with the touch panel. So it's a bit different. Uh, quite glossy as you can see so it's quite hard to film on something like this I know this is touch as well but this is something different it's it has voice activation as well like when I say voice activation you can control your windows and pretty much the temperature you can tell it to and there's a, there's a, um, a command sheet that comes with the paper with the uh, c control module climate control module that send you a A4 paper with all the commands in it so you can learn what to say um, you can't change the voice of the lady because she speaks in a Chinese accent but it, I think it's a bit of a gimmick because we would never use it it, it looks very nice when you want to see it or show it to somebody so it's quite like you know but you say hello Volkswagen and it opens up uh, answers back so I can demonstrate that to you so if we go in here and all the controls are here I don't have heated seats so that's been turned off dual zone I don't have that as well so all those things have been turned off now this is the voice assist so if you turn that on and then go back and then you say hello Volkswagen hello owner what can I do for you open left window okay I close the window for you see I'm saying open it and it thinks I'm saying close hello Volkswagen Hello owner, what can I do for you? Open left front window. Hello Volkswagen. Hello owner, what can I do for you? Open right front window. Hello Volkswagen. Hello owner, what can I do for you? Change temperature gear to 2. Hello Volkswagen. Hello owner, what can I do for you? Change gear temperature to 1. See, it doesn't respond half the time. Hello Volkswagen. Hello Volkswagen. Hello owner, what can I do for you? Open front windows. Okay, I open the window for you. See that, it's open this window. Hello Volkswagen. Hello owner, what can I do for you? Close front window. Okay, I close the window for you. There you go. And if you say right, it thinks that I'm saying left. If I say left, it thinks I'm saying right. Can't change that. So, I mean, when you're driving, it is a bit sort of, you know, you want to change the temperature. You can't, you don't really know what you're doing. You have to see it to know what you're doing, um, which is a pain. And I, I don't understand how Teslas work because in a Tesla that's what happens as well because you've got a screen and everything is gives you the um, sort of a haptic feedback and stuff but I don't understand uh, how, how you're gonna like change something sometimes a knob is quite important to have that's why it's uh, it's one of those things where um, I'm coming I'm going to revert back to the old knob you know the button style controllers this is definitely not something I would have in the car it doesn't sort of give a good uh, feel to it when you're driving uh, and you want to instantly sort of you know t change the temperature you can't do that you have to tap 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 and then tap 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 and then it's just uh, it's like a it's, 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 it's like having a tablet uh, you know on a screen and it's definitely not something that I would uh, want to use but if anybody wants to change it to this version, go for it. I think it, it looks fancy. So if you, for example, you want to sell a car, having this will definitely give a desirable effect. But otherwise, I think it's um, it's more of a gimmick than buying it. And so yeah, just keep that in mind. Um, in the night time, it looks quite nice. And also, it also has this uh, so-called virtual dash. You can't change any of the clocks, the speedos, it's in kilometers. You can't change the miles, you can't change, I mean, the Audi look because we're in a Golf, but it's got S on it, it looks like an Audi. Uh, I know VW is part of Audi, but this, 
speedometer is something it, it should say R line or something like that but it doesn't it just says what it does so yeah I mean the the front car that you see has a function so if I open the door and close the door it tells you that so nothing fancy that, that's what that's what it is but anyway um, I hope you like this video and uh, thanks for watching uh, until next time bye for now